Have you ever wondered how ancient civilizations managed their water resources? How they built structures to control and direct the flow of water, a vital resource, centuries before modern technology? Today we delve into the fascinating history of one such architectural marvel, the Kalanai Dam, also known as the Grand Anikut, a testament to the engineering prowess of an era long past. In the heart of Tamil Nadu, India, across the Kaveri River, stands the Kalani Dam, the fourth oldest water diversion structure in the world, and the oldest in India that's still in use. The origins of this ancient dam date back to around 150 common era, when it was constructed by King Karakala of the Chola dynasty. Originally, the dam was built with the intent to divert water to the delta districts for irrigation, a critical factor in the agricultural prosperity of the region. The dam, made of unhewn stone, is 329 meters long, 20 meters wide, and 5.4 meters high. Despite the passage of centuries, it stands in excellent condition, a testament to the advanced engineering skills of the Chola dynasty. As the Kaveri River approaches the dam, it splits into two branches at a point west of Kalanai. One branch retains the name Kaveri, while the other is known as Kolidam. The dam serves the purpose of directing water for irrigation via canals and to the northern delta branch, Kolidam or Kolarun. Fast forward to the 19th century, and we find the dam undergoing modifications under British rule. The aim was to increase the dam's capacity, a task that was accomplished without compromising the original structure. The Kalanai Dam became a model for later engineers, its design and function inspiring the construction of future water diversion structures. The effects of the dam on the local agriculture were profound. Initially, the ancient irrigation network irrigated an area of about 69,000 acres. However, by the early 20th century, this had increased to an impressive 1 million acres. The Delta farmers of Tamil Nadu have long demanded recognition for King Karikala for his instrumental role in building the dam. In summary, the Kalanai Dam, with its origins in the Chola dynasty, is an ancient engineering feat that has stood the test of time. Its construction was a pivotal point in the history of water management, not just in India, but in the world. It was built with the primary aim to irrigate the Delta districts, a purpose it continues to serve today. The 19th century modifications by the British amplified its capacity, making it a model for future engineers. The dam's impact on local agriculture has been substantial, increasing the irrigated area from 69,000 acres to 1 million acres over the centuries. So the next time you think of ancient architecture and engineering marvels, remember the Kalanai Dam, a testament to the ingenuity of the past and its continuing relevance today.